You're close to Elon. What's your relationship with Elon? And tell us some stories. I've known him well over the last 20 plus years. Elon has a little bit of an edge, right? The momentum that he has created is a whole flywheel in and of itself. The Midas touch, if you will, the, the presumption of succeeding is so strong that anything he now wants to go do, he's sort of bending the rules of what's humanly possible because he doesn't have to deal with the friction of rejection. If he says he wants to go do it, he's going to go do it at this point. You know, there was always a famous Donald Trump quote, you're as rich as the banks will let you be. Um, I think that that is fundamentally true of entrepreneurs. If you are a if you're a force of nature, it's really about how much credit is somebody going to give you to go out and do these things. I don't, I don't know if anybody's ever said this, but I, I think Elon is probably one of the greatest salesmen of all time. I mean, he is P.T. Barnum all the way. He believes in the things he says, which is really important. And he also has a very idealistic view of how things should be. He keeps saying that he is a, you know, sort of physics based bottoms up thinker. This idea of being first principles is really about understanding how to definitively say no to bad ideas and bad ideas can come from experts, right? He's willing to step across that business risk moment and just say, yeah, but it should be this way. 